Hi, I'm uh, demoing titanium order completion uh, using Aptana in Eclipse. Um, first thing I'm going to do is import the file I made, uh, the reference file I made. Um, we have to create a new profile because um, Eclipse wasn't letting me drag and drop files in there. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. Um, I'm going to select the file. I have mine just on my desktop, timobile.js. Um, so there we have the file. Um, next, we also have to set the default editor for JavaScript, so that's an Eclipse Preferences, General, um, Editors, File Associations. Uh, scroll down and find the .js file, and we're going to set the default as Aptana. Click Default and then OK. Um, the next thing we're going to do is uh, add a project. Um, I'm going to go File, uh, New Project. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to select the previously created uh, Titanium project. Mine's just called te Test. I'm um, just select the root directory, or you can select the resources directory, um, and click Choose. I'm just going to call this Test. Okay, so we uh, we now have a Titanium project in here. Um, within my resources, I'm going to locate the app.js file. Now this is a uh, JavaScript code defaultly created by Titanium when you create the project. Um, but within this JavaScript file, um, and using the, the reference file we added earlier, we now have autocomplete uh, for both variables and, um, and the various uh, Titanium namespaces. So um, firstly, you'll see, if I want to create a new Titanium uh, object, I have the whole API uh, um, I have the whole API uh, available. Um, and so I can easily create new, um, new Titanium objects. But um, Aptana is really good because it also works with assignments. So here in the template file, I have a variable win1 that's getting assigned by titanium.ui.create window. Um, and if I now take win1, it now has the properties of a titanium.ui.window, um, including adding event listeners. As you see, um, we have event listeners with a description of the function um, and the function parameters. Um, I've added the various properties, like um, I believe uh, dot uh, title image, um, etc. But I've also implemented the various getters and setters that uh, Titanium uh, uh, allows. So Titanium allows assign, assigning of properties via uh, um, directly to the property or via getters or setters, uh, which is very nice. Um, one thing to note, this is still a work in progress. Um, if you notice that the getter for, say, uh, for, say the anchor point, dot get anchor point, uh, does show uh, descriptions about that uh, object, but um, the actual anchor point uh, says no documentation available. Uh, I, I'm trying to fix that, I'm not sure why. I'm working on an Eclipse plugin version of this autocomplete, but um, again, having some problems getting to work that, getting that to work exactly. Uh, so thanks for listening. Bye.